contest is a steel cage match. Making his way to the ring from Mexico, weighing in at 232 pounds, Rob Buck. Looking out at the countless members of the WWE Universe in attendance, they are all here because of matches like this one. He has a big match ahead of him. Going to need a career-making performance here tonight. And his opponent, representing the Islanders from San Juan, Puerto Rico, weighing in at 232 pounds, Calaretto Death Fraga. We talk a lot about locker room dynamics. You'll never hear a single negative thing backstage about this superstar. Oh, that is what happens when you treat your fellow superstars with respect. They respect you right back. There are no awards for congeniality here in WWE. That respect means nothing if you lose. Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide in a steel cage match. And I'm not sure either one of these competitors really mind. Oh, this will definitely show what these superstars are made of. You're either the hunter or the prey here. It's sometimes both, depending on how long the match lasts. Which reminds me, stamina and conditioning are huge in a steel cage. Well, isn't stamina a factor in every match, Corey? Oh, true, but you don't have to scramble to the top with a bunch of steel mesh in every match. Or pull somebody down off of the cage, either. The steel cage offers some very unique challenges and opportunities. And look at this now, yes, applying the submission hole. Turned that one around. Sam Jawbreaker. You can pick up your teeth in the third row. He deflects it right back. He's making his way up the side of the cage. It's going to take a lot of willpower to make it all the way to the top. Heading up and maybe heading out. Boom, what impact. Impressive counter. Needs to be careful, though. Every movement is a dangerous one. Oh, no. Oh, man. And every inch climb puts you in a more perilous position. Oh, God, that hurt. He can do it here. Strong kick out, but you have to wonder if he can keep it up. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. Gosh. Enough already. And an impressive amount of offense against him here. Yeah, and he keeps struggling to slow the opposition down. Looking for a grip to get themselves over the cage. Trying desperately to escape. Getting ever so close to the very peak of the steel cage. Thrown from the cage down to the mat. That's a tough break at this point in the match. Takes incredible guts to make this climb. 
And here we go. He's headed up the cage. In search of some footing to make this huge climb. He's looking down the cage from the top. And would you look at that? He could be well on his way to escaping the steel cage. He just has to swing that leg over. He's all the way to the top of the cage. Not many options for him. Byron, how can a superstar take advantage of an opportunity when locked in the cage? It isn't. Oh, no. Oh, no. Please don't. No, no, no. He's ripped from the cage and sent hurtling down. Call the paramedics. This one is just about over. He's nearly there. Just a few more sure-footed steps, and he's victorious. Heck of a view from up there, but he'll enjoy a view from the floor even more. worth it now. When you introduce the enclosure, everything is possible. What a match this was. This is the type of victory where you really have to weigh the costs against the benefits. With a win like this, things have got to taste a little bittersweet right about now. Actually, Saxton, I imagine the win tastes a lot more like pennies.